let's now understand about range the first measure of dispersion so what do i mean by range see this is defined as the difference between the two extreme values so the difference between the largest and the smallest value in a distribution is known as your range so higher value of range would imply higher dispersion and vice versa absolute measure of dispersion is what range is all about and it is computed on the basis of the spread of values okay what is coefficient of range see this is a relative measure of dispersion and it is used to compare variation of two series expressed in different units so the ratio between the largest and the smallest value to this sum is your coefficient of range let's do some problems on range now let us now calculate the range and its coefficient once we know and we have understood what exactly is range now we are calculating this for continuous series so when you have been given continuous series then first what you have to check is if the given series is exclusive distribution or not if not then we'll have to convert it into an exclusive distribution now here in this example we already have been given in an exclusive distribution so we'll just directly move to the formula okay now the formula to calculate range is l minus s what is l l would be your upper limit of the highest class interval so the upper limit of the highest class interval is as you can see here 70 see in this particular data which we have been given it is 70 now s here is the lower limit of the lowest class interval which is 10 so what i'll do is i'll say l mi minus s that is 70 minus 10 is equal to 60 and that is my range so as you can see here i have calculated the range which is 60 now we have been asked to find out the coefficient of range which is l minus s divided by l plus s so l as i just told you is nothing but the upper limit of the highest class interval and s is the lower limit of the smallest class interval so l minus s we already know is 60 divided by l plus s which is 80 so i will get coefficient of range equal to 0 0.75